Morning everybody, Coach Rail here and it's day 42 of 90 of running over an hour of a, uh, over running over an hour a day. Um, and today I ran the fastest I, I, don't, I think I've ever ran in my life. I feel amazing. You know what? Hey, look at this. Shorts, no gloves, no hat, no fleece. I mean, what a difference a plane ride makes. I've been in seven, six different cities, seven different states in the last five days and you know what now I'm back in sunny California and a lot of people are saying why and that brought me to the message of the day just keeping it real and it's do you want it or are you just talking about it I mean do you really want it or are you just talking about it see that's what I love that saying because most people are just talking about it that's why 98% of the success in our world is enjoyed by only 2% of the people because only 2% of the people are willing to go out there and get it and it really takes really one thing to get out there and get your victory and that's called sacrifice sacrifice sacrifices are you really willing to make those sacrifices so that's what this message is about today and I'm going to share with you three sacrifices that I'm willing to make number one is I'm willing to sacrifice time with my family that I so much value so that I can have all the time I want with them for the rest of my life that's why I'm also out there traveling the country helping others to to achieve their dreams their victories because you help enough people to have what they want and you will have everything capital bolded that you need that's scriptural number two I'm giving up fishing I put the poles down I walked away from fishing and and that's why I like to do shots by water because I see water my heart starts to pump I love to fish I could fish 24 7 365 but I'm making the sacrifice of not fishing so that I can have the, all the fishing I want whenever I want, with whomever I want, wherever I want for the rest of my life. And number three, something I'm a sacrifice, it's not even a sacrifice, I'm just going to stop it, is TV. To me, that's the biggest waste of time right now. I, and it's so dark, it's demonic, it's just getting crazy. It's ruining the families, it's ruining relationships, it's ruining marriages, it's ruining the youth which is the future of our country, so I'm just gonna stop. I mean, you know, there's always an exception. There's good shows, educational shows, some family shows, but in general, I'm just gonna stop. So my question to you is, what are you willing to sacrifice so that you can have your victory? So that you can go out there and claim what is yours, because how sad will that be if you go around your entire life and don't actually realize the greatness that you were created to have? And trust me, I promise you, you're not just here taking up space. You have greatness in you. You have a calling. There's a reason you're here on this earth. So with that said, the other thing I always talk about is your purpose, your why, okay? So I wanna introduce you to my why. I'm gonna share with you why I do what I do. I hope you wanna join me. My challenge to you is respond to this message with three things that you're willing to sacrifice in the next 45 days to help you to achieve your dreams and your goals. I hope that helps. Peace. Here, check out my purpose. That's my family right there and that's why I do what I do. You know, I, I have those pictures on my iPhone, my smartphone, my iPad, my computer. I have them on my fridge everywhere. And I also like to have specific pictures. There's my smoking hot wife, Michelle Andrews. That's why I do what I do and she's my rock. This is a young picture. This is when we first met. I like to have pictures of either when I first meet somebody or with my kids. As you can see, that's my oldest son, Marcus. He's a stud, champion. But here's his young picture because as you can see, he's got that young, that innocence in his face before he was jaded, before negativity was put in, before, um, you know, adversity, before bullying, before all of that stuff that is thrown in the world and then all of a sudden they stop believing. They think they're not able to do this. We get stuck in that box. So I like to have pictures around the beginning because why grow up when you can have an extraordinary life? Why grow up when you can have life on your own terms? Why grow up when you can be happy? That's why we make the sacrifices. Here's my middle son, Nathan. He's my mini me. So proud of him. Once again, there he is. Little baby, big smile, excited. There's my beautiful baby girl, Danica. That is my daddy's favorite girl. Bear, love my bear. That's my dog. 
I love this picture here because that's my boy, Martin Luther King. He was willing to sacrifice his life so we could live the life that we live. My kids say, Daddy, we wouldn't be born if it wasn't for Martin Luther King because you would have never met Mommy. Man, talk about that. Here's a picture of my family. I love this one because the founder of our company that I'm so proud to be a part of, Advocare, said one day we will walk the beaches together. And because of making a choice, making a decision, and making many sacrifices, that's what my family is doing today. We are walking the beaches of the world together. So listen, go out there, make some sacrifices, let's get it done. I hope that helps. Peace. This message is for you, about you, because of you. If it made a difference in your life, if you liked what you heard, please share it with somebody else. You never know whose life you're going to change. Have a great day. God bless.